Hi guys, in this video we would be installing and running a docker nginx container using terraform and accessing nginx via browser. Let us start. Open your browser and type keyword docker space terraform. This should open up a docker registry page that is the second link over here. Doc docs overview terraform registry. Here you could see a docker provider configuration. Now please open your IDE and create one file. Let us call it as a main.tf. Let us create a second file which is for providers and let us call it as a provider.tf. Let us copy the docker provider configuration and paste it in provider.tf file. Please note that Docker and uh, Terraform is installed before we start this exercise. Now let us uh, go to the terminal and uh, let us type uh, Terraform in it. Uh, this command after entering it, it will go to a Docker reg Terraform registry and install the Docker uh, uh, provider into your uh, local uh, directory you can check with the ls minus lr command in dot uh, terraform folder this would be the let us run uh, uh, another command let us open another terminal here we can check uh, docker uh, container uh, list space container list this would uh, tell us uh, what all the containers are currently running in my laptop we could see nothing is running that's zero nothing let us use another command which is docker ps uh, i think yeah there is another command here, ps minus a this would give us uh, what all the containers are running currently on my laptop that's a push queue uh, check out contain uh, containers are running currently so let us uh, now go to, uh, uh, let us create a docker container using Terraform. You can uh, copy this as well. Uh, as is, we can use it. Otherwise, click on resources. Uh, uh, these are all the resources of Terraform, which will interact with uh, Docker. Click on docker container. Co uh, in this example, uh, it is basically Ubuntu container uh, it is creating it let us copy this same example and copy it into a, a main.tf file let us uh, uh, give a appropriate name currently in this case we would be installing nginx and uh, let us uh, rename it as nginx so if you could see here uh, docker container is having a reference to docker image Docker image, uh, you could, if you could see, it's a name that is given as a nginx. In this case, what will happen is during when uh, Terraform applies this event, then uh, our Terraform goes to a Docker Hub registry and it uh, pulls out the nginx contain in nginx image present in the Docker Hub registry. Now let us add the uh, uh, port related configuration. Uh, if you remember uh, this uh, snippet, port snippets basically, uh, since our Nginx is a web server, in order to access uh, Nginx, uh, Nginx server, we need to expose few ports in a Docker container resources. Internal port, it is 80, it is basically a container uh, internal port where uh, Nginx is running. External port is 8080, you can give any port number basically for external. It is basically from your laptop on which port you would be uh, accessing this nginx. So internally, internal port is container internal port where it is it's our container is running. So now let us go to the next command. Terraform plan, it will give a dry run and check how many resources it has to take. In this case, two resources. One is docker image and second one is the docker container. Now let us run uh, uh, terraform apply this this is basically once uh, uh, deploys those two resources let us enter yes in this case what will happen is it will uh, uh, 
pulls the image from a docker hub registry that is what a docker pulls the image and next one is a docker underscore container which should spin up a nginx server let us give us a couple of seconds uh, roughly it should take 20 to 30 seconds so, now if you see docker image docker container both created okay with the, both the two resources are bad let us check the again the same part docker container list if here you could see nginx is uh, running 10 seconds ago it has run process also let us check it so if you see here the yeah, container it is running up and 23 seconds ago it was running it and our uh, exposed port is 8080 external we need to access with this particular url and the internal it is 80 as uh, as the things we added so now let us uh, open our browser again and uh, what we would be doing is uh, open the browser uh, and type localhost 8000 it should uh, uh, go to a request to our container which is we are running and it should serve our uh, in index uh, page of nginx voila magic uh, if you could see here this is served by our uh, container that's good right this video was requested by one of our viewers so if you are interested in any specific uh, topic or any tool please comment on one of our video we would be more than happy to create it for you guys. If you are interested in learning more about multi-cloud and DevOps tools, please subscribe this channel and like this video. Thank you.